Hello, my name is Gary Talbot and welcome to the T&T Teaching and Learning YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you an activity that you can use in your classroom as either a starter or a plenary uh, to get pupils to um, recall information uh, that you previously taught them. Uh, and this is something which is called Tarsia puzzles. Now you might have seen these uh, used before uh, or you might be totally brand new to Tarsia puzzles. So basically Tarsia puzzles are, as you can see on the, um, the screen, uh, it's certain shapes um, that you build together um, where pupils match up certain answers. So this one in this example is uh, mathematical equations and what pupils have to do is they have to match up um, one side of the triangle with the answer on another side of the triangle. Now you can do this with questions um, or you can use uh, you know maths equations or answers and, and, and maths equations. You can use uh, different shapes so it doesn't always have to be a, a big triangle there are other shapes that you can use to, to make it more difficult. Um, one of the uh, ways you can do this is there's actually some free so software you can get online by clicking on <clears throat> the link uh, here. I will put this link in the description below. Um, it can be quite difficult to create the tarsiers at first uh, but once you've, you've you know, started doing it and you get used to it, it it's quite easy and quite quick uh, to do them and obviously once you've got that you can save that file um, for future. Um, again it does it a bit time consuming because you have to um, cut them out um, and have them ready for pupils um, when you start the lesson to, to avoid them wasting time cutting them out themselves. You could get them also to make their own Tarsier puzzles so you could give them uh, blank triangles and get them to make their own which is you know a, a higher order skill. Um, so that's just another use of it. It's quite engaging because people like to put puzzles together um, and, and try just try it in your lesson and see if it works. Uh, if you like this video please click the, the like button below and uh, if you want any more uh, videos, future videos or updates on future videos please subscribe to our YouTube channel. And that's it, thank you very much.